Good morning, boys and girls. This is Pastor Mabba here. We're actually in a different location than we normally are for church. We're still at the building, but we are the church. So even if you're not here with us, we're excited that you join us today. And we are reporting live from the CKC Sports Center. Da -na -na, da -na -na. And I have a special guest today. We're going to be talking some more about faith. As you know, all month long, we've been focused on incredible faith and looking at different people in the Bible who had an incredible faith through demonstration of trusting God. So this morning, I actually have a special guest. Um, excuse me, excuse me. I want to introduce you guys to Willie Wannabe James. Good morning. Willie, doing good today. How you doing? I didn't even ask you how you were doing, but that's, that's all good. So I just want the people to hear some things about you because I know some of you guys are at home and they don't have basketball games on TV, they don't have football, they don't have any sports going on, all the things have been canceled. But Willie Wannabe James has been practicing diligently because I think he thinks he's going to bring sports back like never before. So what's going on with you, Willie? Oh, oh, sorry. Willie just looking himself in the monitor. Oh, okay. Willie look good. Willie always look good. <laughs> Will, hey, all I got to say, Willie is the best basketball player you ever meet. Willie, so good, he played with a deflated basketball. Willie don't need a good basketball to play with because Willie play good no matter when it is. Willie, Will, let me talk, let me talk, man, man, man. I, I, know, I, know you, I know you got some stuff to report, but I just really want to tell you that Willie is the best basketball player you ever met. Willie want to be James. Willie, Willie, good. So I'm what just saying. What team has Willie signed with? That's all I want to know. <laughs> Willie played for the San Jose Sharks. The who? The San Jose Sharks. And where is that team? San Jose? <laughs> where you think? San Jose it? where? San Jose. It's in where? the backyard. Oh, okay, okay. I understand, I understand. And you say you played with a deflated ball. So I heard that you could really dunk. I can I, Slam can, I, dunk. I can dunk. Okay. Willie can dunk. Okay. Willie Will, is good. All right. Well, we're, I know we're going to have some opportunity for you to just kind of show some of the kids I, at home. I got pointers. a highlight reel to show everybody. Yeah. Uh, pointers at home. Yeah. We're going to make sure they I'm get a, to see that and everything. Yeah. But my question is, do you have dreams in the future of maybe playing outside your backyard? Because I know you're good in the backyard. Ooh, hey, in my backyard, they call me the king. Okay. Willie okay. the king. King James. Yeah, okay. Professional ball, maybe with, I'm not saying this is who you got your name from, but maybe with people like LeBron James or, you know. You said LeBron James? Yeah, I know you want to be. Can you, can you, I'm sorry. Can you repronounce be, that? Le, LeBron James? Yes, yes. He good? He pretty good. I, I ain't never heard of him. I heard, I heard of Steph Curry yeah, and other players Steph like that. Yeah, but, yeah, yeah. But, LeBron James. So your name, Willie, want to be James, don't have anything to do with LeBron? Willie want to be James? You, you think it's like, really want to be James? No, Willie want to be James. My mama gave me a different name, but I changed it to Willie want to be okay. James. Okay, all right, that explains a lot. My name was Steve Urkel before. Okay, well, Wait. let's just get to the point. Maybe it wasn't Steve Urkel. I, I can tell you, I have talked to a lot of athletes. And some of the most successful athletes out there have faith. Willie don't need faith. Willie trusts in himself. Okay, so you're putting all your trust in yourself. Who else would I put it in? Because, listen, listen I'm to me. I'm Willie. We've been talking, kids, y'all know this, we've been talking about faith. And we know that God gave us the measure of faith, right? But we have to exercise our faith. You, and in order to succeed, what I've heard a lot of people, especially you brought up Steph Carey. Steph Curry. You mm -hmm. brought him up. Uh -huh. He's a man of God. He's a faith person. Yeah, he believes. I, I, I good friends and, with him. I hit him up about every day. Okay. Yeah. I, I didn't know that. I gave him some pointers. Uh, Will, Willie showed him how to shoot a three. I didn't know that. Uh, Willie. Mm -hmm. But I do know that the great players, even when they get discouraged, even when they're told, well, you can't do this, you can't do that, they keep pressing forward by faith. But why would you do it? Everybody says you can't. If they tell you you're not good at it, why you keep doing it? Because faith tells us and reminds us of who God is in us. Oh. And that we can do all things through Christ who strengthens us. So even, even when uh, Steph Curry told me I couldn't shoot, 
If I just trusted in God, I could still do it. He did say something about that. He did say if somebody told you you couldn't shoot, like I just said you couldn't, they, it, it might be help. It might help if you uh, yeah, and you trust rely in God. On, that's right. Just trust huh. on God. Don't and we got to be reminded, especially right now, boys and girls. You may be hearing a lot of things. We don't walk in fear. We walk by faith, not by sight. So no matter what you're hearing about this virus, we know it's drying up. Oh, is gone. Yeah, yeah. That's what our faith says. That's what God has promised us that what we pray and believe we can receive. Just like if you're talking about being a sports athlete. Superstar. Superstar. <clears throat> okay. Like Willie want to be James. No, no. If he puts his faith in God, the higher he can go. Because it's not just in himself that he's believing in, it's God strengthening him to help him reach the next level. It's kind of like a ball, basketball. You play Not basketball, with, right? With a deflated ball? You play ball. basketball. You say with a deflated ball. Deflated ball, yes. Well, I'm thinking, how much better could you play if you had a ball that was full of air? Because if you don't know, boys and girls, the reason the ball bounces is because of what's on the inside. The high it bounces is based on what's on the inside. So I have this deflated ball. I think I would love to see you bounce this ball. We've oh. got a deflated ball. Uh, I can, let, me, let me show y'all how this yeah, is show going. Yeah, show them, show them, show them. I want to see you bounce that deflated <laughs> ball and see how high it goes. You can hold this for me? I can hold that for you. Uh, did y'all see that? I don't even think it made that it above how, my desk. But that's how it's done. That's how it's done. I don't even think it made it above my desk. So, so what's you're, supposed, the, you're supposed to dribble in basketball. You're supposed to dribble it. You're supposed to bounce it. But the reason it does it is because of what's on the inside. The higher the bounce means what's on the inside. And we know basketballs have air on the inside. But if we've got Jesus down on the inside of us, the higher we'll go. Oh. So if See? you're playing with a deflated ball, you're not reaching your full potential. In order to reach our full potential, we've got to be centered in Christ. And when we hear all the things going on with no sports, I know you're figuring you're going to be the next greatest thing I, because nobody else is playing right now. Well, I figure that give me advantage. <laughs> give me you advantage. You know, nobody else is playing right now. You're the only one who would come to the interview because we can only have a certain amount of people here. You know how that go. So you, you saying I was your last resort? Um, I called every league, every team. Oh. And nobody could come and talk to me. Nobody. But when somebody told me about really want to be James, we thought that was the next best thing to getting uh, the message out to the kids. I got you. Okay. Got so, you. so we care about you. God cares about you. But I want you to play to this level as opposed to this level. So what's on the right. inside is what counts. All right. The Bible even tells us that greater is he that's in us, yeah. in me, than he that's in this world. You know. So you may have great players out there but the greatest that we hear about all the time are trusting in what's on the inside of them, which is God. Steph Curry, I, trust yeah. God. Amen. I, I, I think I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to take your advice, and I, I'm, I'm going to stop trusting in myself, James, James, James. Um, but I, I think I'm going to trust the Lord. You going to trust the Lord? I'm going to trust the Lord. Well, you just got to know that if God is for you, who can be against you? Amen. You can reach any goal that you set Hallelujah. out to reach. Hallelujah. And so now you're part of our partnership. Amen. Our Covenant Kids partnership where we're studying faith all month long. You got some good kids. Good kids. They're, they're great kids. Good they're kids. great kids. And we just want you during this time to increase your faith. Amen. To recognize that if God is for you, who can be against you? that greater is he that's in you than he that's in this world. We're going to be bringing you messages the whole time while we're doing this distance church services and everything. So we want you to tune in. We also, on our internet, on our website, actually we'll actually have extra information. There are games that you can play to just build you up in the things of God. Amen? So I think we're going to go to a highlight reel here in just a few minutes with uh, Willie, Willie Wannabe Willie. James. Yes, ma'am. I will never forget that name. Yes, ma'am. But he said he's going to take it to another level I'm in God. take it to another level. He's going to put his trust in God, his faith in God, and God's going to help him to succeed at anything he has that he wants to do. A lot better than playing in his backyard by himself, calling himself really want to be changed. Willie, 
Remember that.